Hi all, Diamond Dagger here. This is a simple instruction video on how to use protection stones on the server so you can have a better experience on the server without griefing. I've set up a small little cuboid, well half a cuboid to illustrate the area that the stone protects. You'll start off with a block of coal ore. You can purchase further coal ores from the shops in the towns or other ores which are used for protecting. It's very simple. When you place the coal ore you get a message as you see this area is now protected and everything outside of the stone within a certain area it's protected. It's simple as that. Nothing else to do. You put it down, and I, here for illustration, a coal ore protects an area 11 by 11 by 11. So you have an 11 cube around you that no one can grief, no one can enter chests, open doors, flick switches, etc. Which is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 blocks from either side of the coal ore. Up and down. It's simple enough. You can do the, exactly the same thing. Yeah, and when removing the coal ore, you'll re you'll receive this back. I'm in creative at the moment, so it just disappears. But you will receive this back. You can use it again at any time. Once you've removed it, the protection is no longer there. And you can do the same thing with lapis ore. Same thing. Put it down. It's protected and you receive double the size area so everything that's 10 blocks either side of the lapis is protected in all directions very simple and the biggest one which will be very expensive is diamond same thing put it down and you're protected I'll go through some of the flags it's very it's self-explanatory once you once you start using it. You put it down, oh just the one. Create your zone, which can overlap, so I could put another one here, but then I'll get into that a little later why that can be uh, difficult. You put it down and there are certain things that you can control within the area. For example, if I now type PS it gives me a list of all the commands that I can do. You can add other players to your protected area if you want to let them do certain things. So for example, if I want to add Coconutter to my list of friends, people that can do something, I've added him to my region. And it gives me a little message saying that I've done so and I can just as easily remove him. Oops, not pass, PS. Coca Nutter. And now he's no longer able to do anything. Other flags include, which again is self explanatory, if you write in PS for protection stone and flag, it'll give you a list of the things that you can do. PS, oh, it didn't this time, I think it's PS flag. No, okay, well, fail. Flags are PvP. You can toggle it to deny or to allow. Same, uh, same setting for all of the flags, deny or allow, so on or off, and they are PvP, use, which includes switches and doors, and buttons, so whether you want to allow other people to be able to use them in the area or not. Chest, dash, access, again self-explanatory, whether people can, other than yourself, can access chests or not. You can even give them a greeting message so when they enter your zone, let's say for example, I want to say welcome, uh, anything after a space will be omitted. So you need to use the underscore welcome to 
diamonds house if I had a house here greeting flag has been set now when you enter the zone it says welcome to diamonds house and I can do the same thing for leaving which is farewell goodbye come oops I did a space there see again soon flag has been set now when I leave goodbye come again soon when I enter welcome to diamonds house so uh, you can set it to whatever you want please try and refrain from using profanities but things like get off my land is a good thing to put which is funny um, I'm trying to think PS flag uh, I mentioned PvP use of switches chests entry exit uh, I think there are some more but basically I've also added a link to the uh, protection stone wiki so that's got all of the information you might need uh, outside of this we're hopefully going to add some other ores to the list other than coal uh, uh, lapis and diamond so you'll have different sized areas that you can use maybe redstone and iron ore in the future but that's something we're working on but until then uh, have fun using your protection stones.